are back. Happy Wednesday. Happy hump day. Yes. Halfway through the week. Closer to Friday. Hopefully everyone's week is going well. I don't know if you came here through the Twitter link or not, but if so, you will know that I still haven't washed my wine glasses. I wish that I could say that they're not clean because I used them again. That's not accurate. I just have not washed them from several weeks ago. I'm pretty sure it's been like a month now. So don't judge me. I'm still a garbage adult. I'll admit it. So this week we're uh, drinking our wine out of a Honeydukes mug. So yay, Harry Potter reference, right? Right? So if you're watching and drinking along, then cheers. Happy Wine and Walker Wednesday. I had another week where I was really, really um, in a Walking Dead mood, so I've been really looking forward to getting to play again and figure out what happens next. All right. So I think we're in chapter three, is that right? Oh no, we're on episode four. Well, that's kind of a dark cover image. Episode four, Amid the Ruins. Hopefully it shows us a, um, what's the word I'm looking for? A flashback? Recap. Recap. Hopefully it shows us a recap because, oh, that's lovely. I don't remember totally what happened last week. I just know that things were bad and shit hit the fan, you know? All right, I need some more. I need another sip for courage before we start. Are you guys ready? Let's do this. Recap, recap. I have cat hair stuck to my lipstick. It's not a very good feeling. <laughs> Alright. Previously on The Walking Dead. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed oh, to? Oh right, the pregnant child? lady. I think she's gonna have her baby this week. It's like a soap I opera. When I, came across at the lodge, I forgot about the Bonnie. Are dead, and I can't help but feel I'm to blame. You kind of are. Fucker. No! No! Stop it! Carver! Get me! Carver, Carver. Get me. When you cover yourself in their smell, you have the walker guts all over you. Oh, right, I forgot about that girl. One of them. I don't remember you what her name was, though. Make sure you're good and covered. Go on. You don't need to see this. Oh, right. Kenny killed him. Let's go. And Kenny's girlfriend, Sarita. The pregnant lady's husband's dead. And the father of her baby is dead. That's not the Kenny I know in there. It's the Kenny we know. I could save him. Yes, it is. Alright. Oh! Did I know that Sarita got bit? Is that where we left off? Really? Really? I don't think I remember that part. Did I cut off her hand? Oh my gosh, we're jumping right in this week. Jeez. I did get a hand in favor, but, um... Oh, I thought she got attacked otherwise. Did she not? Oh no, she's got another bite, right? She's dead, man. Leave her alone! Penny, we have to go. Come on! Get the fuck away from us! This is your goddamn fault! Oh, he's blaming. Kenny! I won't be left alone again. We're gonna leave. 
We're gonna get out of this. Oh. Mm -hmm. Care what these fuckers are saying. You're gonna we be can't fine. let her turn, Kenny. She's going to turn. We can't save no. her. Please, Kenny. No, no, no. Please, don't let her kill you. <laughs> Don't let her do it. What's happening? Are we frozen? She's gonna turn, man. You gotta let go. Oh, jeez. I'm so sorry, Kenny. I don't know that I had a choice, though. I don't. I don't know that I did. What did you do? What the hell is going on? I don't want her to suffer. Suffer now. We have to go. Walkers, walkers everywhere. Oh, and he knows. Chop, chop, chop. Ooh. I forget about the dodging thing. It always takes me unawares. Okay. Trying this again. Are we gonna go back to the Sarita part or just, okay, no, just this part. I feel so bad. Kenny's gonna be really upset that he ran into me. And that's not the impression I wanna leave. I want it to be a happy reunion, you know? I'm going after Sarah. Luke. Did Sarah run? Oh, she did. Yeah. Who the hell is that? Kenny? Kenny, where are you? Are you gonna be okay, man? I kinda doubt it. Um, okay. That's icky. Probably got me smellier though, right? Ugh. Yuck. All right. Are we just looking through the masses? Who do we call for? We'll call for Luke, I guess. Was she gonna grab us either way, no matter who we called for? I can't find anybody. I know. What do we do? I don't know what to do. Locals with me. We're still covered in walker guts. So theoretically, we should be safe, as long as we're not like mom, 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 like that annoying kid in like what is it, season five or season six of the show? Sam was his name, I think. It's gonna be okay. We're gonna make it. I forget her name. Is it Rebecca? Okay. I can't remember. We can clear path to the trees. Maybe they're sitting out somewhere. Do you see any openings? Anything? Clear. We've got a heart. Um, we have to find a way through. How? Oh, like that. I took too long. I took too long. All right. We're going to try that again, I guess. Brave! Hi! Welcome, welcome! Good to see you. How have you been? We're definitely in a zombie situation. We're uh, stuck in a little herd right now. And Kenny is pissed at us. His new girlfriend, Sarita, is zombie food. And he's blaming us. And now we can't find him in the herd. So Okay. Rot row. We in trouble. We can clear path to the trees. 
so the pregnant lady who never liked me has found me and now she's very very happy that she found me um i'm supposed to be finding a path where right there can we go to it let's go pregnant lady i forget her name vandras hi thank you for the lurk thank you for the bits i hope your work day is going well I don't remember that girl's name. Becca! Thank you, Brave. I've been trying to remember her name. I just keep calling her the pregnant lady. Which, I mean, it's not wrong. Better to spread out. You guys are fine. Just go. I'll stay close and watch out for Rebecca. Your choice. Maybe I shouldn't have. Uh, so if a zombie, like, eats Rebecca, it's kind of like a two-for-one deal. Is that too dark to say? Should I not go there? Should I have not stayed with Rebecca? Move, Rebecca! She gonna get us killed! Just tell me what to do. We'll get through this. We'll get through it, right? That one looks light enough to carry I'm gonna get on the far side. Oh, we're actually gonna carry a dead walker with us? Interesting. New tactic. I like it. Strategy. Alright. Oh, whoops. Was I supposed to axe her? I told you to distract it. I thought that I did. Oh, is she doing what Michonne did? Stay close. If you fall behind, I can't come back for you. Ah. Hurry up. Okay, where am I supposed to? It says don't fall behind. Do I just walk? Is that it? Miranda or Miranda? I have no idea. I cannot remember for the life of me. I remember Luke. I have no idea why my mod bot thought that crazy lady was a bad term that I had to approve. That's bizarre. Vanders, did I thank you for the bits and for the lurk? Thank you so much. And the follow. Goodness, thank you. I don't know if I missed that or not, but thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Episode 4, Amid the Ruins. Alright. Buttery Luke. Where did Luke end up? He makes me feel safe because it's Scott Porter's voice. Mr. Motivation, hi! What's up? Well, what's up is that I think this pregnant lady is about to pop. I'm a little afraid for our lives here. And I can't remember this other girl's name. All right. No, I'm not all right. Can I say cuckoo bananas? Absolutely. It'll be a lot better once we get with the others. We need to make sure everyone else made it out. I actually oh, love that expression, so cuckoo bananas. Whenever people use it, it makes me happy inside. I don't know why. It's so much more fun to say. If they aren't, nothing we can do about it. Wizard of Time, thank you for the lurk and for the bits. Thank you so much. Jesus. Oh my goodness. What if the herd is still following? Thank you guys. Mini Punny, hello. Mini Punny, Poony. I don't know which one is right. We'll watch out for Hopefully I said it right. Thanks so much for hanging out. We just escaped a herd. The pregnant lady froze and was terrified. I know I should feel glad that we escaped, but I just can't stop thinking I'm pretty sure she's gonna have a baby soon. stupid. What was? Escaping? Look, I know we all agreed to use the herd to get we out. We did agree. Maybe we should have been more patient. We must have washed off all that walker bad. blood at some it point. Worked. Jane is her name? Working. We could have. Her name is know. Jane? Jane saved us. I don't know how. Wow, I was with you. I thought it started with an M, Brave. Give yourself enough credit. I'm just saying that if people hadn't panicked, things might have turned out better. Of Jane course. seems pretty badass, we guys. We were scared. The plan was good. The execution was the messy part. 
That sounds Don't incredible. you dare drop your water, Becca, I swear. No, Seriously. No, Seriously. Oh, Just, Minnie Pony, uh, thanks so much for the bits. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. Aw. Thank you guys for coming to hang out in the stream. Now. Can I just have a minute? Uh, I think she's about yeah. to have her baby. What do you guys think? Thank you. I really think so. <laughs> I don't know if you guys came here through Twitter or not, but no if you did, you'll know that I um, is still Alvin have not is washed Thanks my wine me. glasses. <laughs> so we're drinking out of a Honey Duke's mug this about... week. No. Harry Potter reference, yay! So, if you have anything to drink as well, cheers! Wine and Walker Wednesday. What are you going to do with it? What do you mean by that? Uh, sorry, just making conversation. How's everybody's week What's going that? so far? No. What do you mean by that? Do with what? Jane Cuckoo wow, Bananas. Maybe? I'm just looking yeah. at the worst case Right, scenario. Jane? You and Clem will I swear, her name was not Jane school. last week. Not out here. I just mean it's going to need food and, you know, other stuff. We'll look after it together, even if that's the case. Morally, can't I can't abandon everyone. the baby. Thinking completely strategically, that's going to be rough. Just you're some angry loner who doesn't care about anyone rough. but herself doesn't mean you know better than me. Hey, I've seen it before. Back when it started, oh. me and my sister, we what? were... Who is your died? sister? You kind of look like Molly from Savannah. I don't need your pity. She does, right? Or am I you just don't. imagining that? You I might be imagining that. Right. Jane! Are we gonna learn Jane's Shit. backstory? Shit. Jane, wait. So far, so good. How about yours? Damn it. My week has been good. It has. I feel like I haven't been very productive, and yet I've been making a lot of highlight videos and getting my VODs onto YouTube and stuff. But... It doesn't make me feel productive, like, at all. I wish that it did. <laughs> I bet she's got a million IDs. Empty those pockets, Jane. Seriously, Jane and Molly, same person now. We've decided. Work gets in the way of all of our fun. Work always gets in the way of fun. A meeting in 20. Well, I hope your meeting goes well for you. I told you. That's why we're waiting. As soon as everyone I'm else managing. Gets here, oh, Kenny survived! Guys, Kenny's, Kenny's alive! What? No. I to go out and try to find him. I'm not that excited about Bonnie. She was kind of creepy last week, but Kenny's alive. I tried to talk to Kenny. He flipped out on me. I don't I know if he's gonna. Scary shit. Damn it, Bonnie's alive, right? Right? It was scary. Is Kenny gonna flip out on us again? He got real mad at us. I've been nervous to go near him. What? You think he's gonna shoot you? The way he is right now? I don't know. Maybe. We need he's Kenny. Maybe, Maybe I should have said it was my fault, because it kind of was. Kenny's help. Kinda. Clem? I just don't want to admit to it. You're here. Oh, that was a really Maybe annoying voice. Okay. I'll do it. I'll talk to him. Okay. Hopefully he won't try to fight me to feel better like he did with Lee, because now I'm not... A big, tall, Sorry. strong man. I'm a little eleven-year-old girl. Please forgive me. <laughs> I can't be alone again. Oh, Kenny. Hi, Kenny. He's a dick sometimes, but I feel for him, you know. Oh. You think I don't know what y'all are whispering about oh. over there? The gloomiest guy in the That's Sunshine State. I love that. Why is Kenny acting that way. Do you think it's Kenny's perfect okay? for Kenny? It's all I hear from anyone anymore. Favorite foul mouth Floridian. Alliteration. I love it. Kenny. I don't I'm so I sorry think Kenny's gonna self-combust. What do you think? Well, that's nice of you. Seeing as this was your fault in the first place. You guys. Ah. Uh, there was nothing I could do. Seeing how things turned out, I think I might have preferred you do nothing. No. Oh. I'm sorry, Kenny. Where is Lee? Lee needs to come back. I tried to save her. You think because you're a little girl, you can just get people killed and no one will care? That because you're sorry, it'll all magically go away? Kenny's an angry dude. That's not how it works. And he's a cyclops now. That probably won't make him any less angry. Not for the last time. Just get the fuck out of here and leave me alone. 
I'm going crazy just sitting here. I feel bad. Right. Just give it time, Mike. It's still early. I feel so bad. Huh. How'd it go? Isn't my southern accent fantastic? It's just perfect. Kenny's really Kenny's mad. Kenny's really mad. Um, you can't just expect. What was her husband's bad. name? It started with an A. That man's going through. <laughs> oh, for God's sake, Kenny, look with the other eye. Food, water. It's getting damn cold. So do we have a new group now? But where? Where's Luke? I need Scott Porter's voice back in my life. Mike, honey. Mike's got a point. You can't just keep sitting around waiting. We should have Jane lead us. That girl seems to know what's going on. on your hands, too. What? Suddenly you're pretending to be concerned? We should go find Luke, Sarah, and Jane's just very practical, if Becca. In trouble, we might be able to help them. Love your southern accent. I love accents. I think they're so much fun. I'm not necessarily very good at them, but I like to play with them. Clem can come with me. Oh, me? Really? She chose me? Thanks, Jane. Slash Molly. Thank you. Slash whoever you are. Oh, poor Kenny. Listen, Rebecca. I don't want to think about wrong, Kenny anymore. It's too sad. I've got this. You don't think I'd need to. I don't know. But you better keep that close. Come on, Clara. I'm coming, I'm coming. Let's go, Jane. Is that a real statue somewhere? I'm kind of curious now if it is. I don't know. I just saw myself on stream drinking from this mug. It totally looks like I'm drinking tea or something. Deceptive. Look, I'm gonna level with you. You should know that finding your friends. You said. <laughs> I don't know about that. I feel like I did the you same thing earlier when I was wondering okay. if a walker well, ate I Becca if it would be like for a two for one, one meal. Friends. Like, <laughs> you wouldn't have made it this far if you weren't smart. But I still. I just oh, I got this it. mug in Florida in Universal at the Harry Potter the theme park. Cracking. I went to Honeydukes and I had to leave with well, a souvenir. A lot of I also got a cauldron cake and um. Oh, what was the other thing I, I got? You see what I'm talking about. I got a cauldron cake you and. Don't be here when they start. You know, bad stuff happens to you when you're alone, too. What else did I get? I don't remember. Nobody to I got a couple back. things at Honey you Dukes because, I don't know, I got a lot of souvenirs at Harry Potter because how can you not? I was so I excited to be there. I was like, I'm going to buy everything. He's, going through, he's more of a liability than anything. And Rebecca's situation is not making things better back there. Well, that's true. You get enough broken people together. And all you're gonna get are broken decisions. She's just worried, just about, worried about, about her baby. baby. I mean, wouldn't you be? I wouldn't bring a kid into this world. Maybe like she tried said, not to. It's her baby, not mine. How about the butterbeer and chocolate frogs? Yes, so that's what it was—a chocolate I frog. Like I bought room, two chocolate frogs to come home with. Fall apart. And then, people get killed. When I wasn't looking, my dog ate my chocolate frog. And yet somehow did not damage the packaging that it was in at all. I'm actually really impressed, although I'm upset that she ate the chocolate frog. Partially because I wanted it and partially because she's not supposed to have chocolate. My sister Jamie had a good leather. At least I got half of it. You could have. Yeah, thanks so much, Minnie Punny, Minnie Pooney. I'm just gonna call you Minnie. <laughs> Thank you, Minnie. Have a really good meeting. Did the wolf guy scare you? The wolf guy? Make my Wait, what wolf guy? A game that we were secret sisters. It was stupid kid stuff. Stupid kid stuff. Mm. You know, being a big sister is well. I was also funny. upset because with it's my really chocolate frog. Yes, oh? that's exactly what I was gonna say, Jeff. Hello. Welcome to the stream, by the way, Jeff. I got two chocolate haircut. frogs, and I got them in two different haircut? containers. Oh, one was cardboard and I mean, one was tin, because I thought I the I get it out. tin one like would last better as no, I, um, souvenir. Awful, the tin ones don't come with cards. What could I do? 
I was so upset. That's why they're more expensive and they're fancier and they last longer, but they don't have cards. Every summer we go to this. Only the cardboard ones have cards. But the best part. It was a guy with a red beard. That's what I remember. I don't remember his name, but I think it starts with an A. I'd pretend we weren't sisters. I know right where it is. I could run and get it. Maybe I will if we break. At Universal, who slides up to you and goes, Oh, All right. I didn't have that happen. Nobody howled at me. No wolf man howled at me. I'm kind of sad now. I did meet Stan Shunpike from the night bus, and he was awesome. They're just walkers. And we saw Creature in the window. Well, pretty recently they weren't. I don't think it was Godric Gryffindor. I think it started. Take a look. With an A. A waste of time. It was somebody I'd never heard of before. Pagers. But these ones weren't walkers all that long. I ago. did, then I got thrown out of the park for hitting him. Oh my gosh. Brave. Some of the stories that you have there should back. be a book. Let's see what else he's got. For real. Check this one. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Maybe that's why uh, nobody does that anymore. It scared too many people. Hi, JW. JJW. Welcome, welcome. How are things going? We are simultaneously talking about some Harry Potter and Walking Dead. Driver's licenses, two of them. Well, I guess some people just can't leave the past behind. Maybe Jane's gonna want them with all her fake IDs. He said, oh, what the hell? I said, wait, it's not a real wolf. <laughs> Dead Walker's pocket. In their arm? Is it a hidden pocket? Is it a fancy coat Sorry, like I Carly think. used to have? Thanks. So, has your crew always been so dysfunctional? Cheers. You fit in there. Um. But you weren't like them. I've actually only been with them a little while. I was with Lee before, and he was, was like amazing. I got there. But Kenny was different. I know that. That's it. Is anyone else better at being a grown-up than I am? A nail file. Like I'm genuinely a curious. Sharpen a blade. Strike a My wine glasses are really cute. Jamie always had one in her purse. I showed them on stream a couple weeks ago, but I haven't washed them since. So our wine and walker Wednesdays have been with different stuff that's clean. This week it happens to be a Honey Duke mug that I got in the Harry Potter theme park. Last week it was a Batman mug. Before that it was a Batman sure cup. Before that it was a Star Here, Wars cup. So it has. It's been four weeks, you guys, since I washed my wine glasses. How horrible is that? I'm a garbage junk, like, a junk grown-up. Just garbage. Please tell me that you guys do stuff like that, too. He's or let me know if I just really sense. am garbage. That's okay. Like your friend, didn't <laughs> I'll own it. Sorry. I don't know what to tell you. All Does it mean she she's dead? Here. It could be a good sign. Oh, we lost the doctor, too, up. right? Look, Clem, I know what you want me to say. You and your sister poisoned the penguin at SeaWorld? Shit. With a slushy? We gotta find a way in. How did nobody stopped we'll you from giving the penguin a slushy? Really? Oh no. Oh, what's this? Oh, is that Nick? It's Nick. Wasn't Luke with you? Oh, he did get shot, right? As Look, we were escaping through the herd. We should do this. I don't want to take out Nick. I'm sorry. I am sorry, Nick. Wow, his teeth went bad real fast. I'm so sorry, Nick. I'm taking out all kinds of people these days. 11 year old and I've already got at least three kills under my belt. And I'm pretty sure more than that. I haven't counted. I wish I had counted. We asked the trainer if it could eat anything. He said, sure. So we fed it slushy, and the trainer said, no, not sugar. <laughs> Was the penguin okay? Like, did he stop you in time? That's a really gross shot, by the way. His brain it's is, like, right. sliced. It's done. 
it comes to it, Blech. if Luke or Saren or anybody needs to be put down, you gotta be ready for it. No hesitation. It never gets any easier, does it? I bet it will be easier than for me. taking a Lee. That hatchet of yours seems to get stuck pretty easily. It's gonna get you killed. Here, use this. An ice pick like Lee used to use. Very effective. We can do this. It exploded? Oh my god, the poor penguin! So it it died? Oh, you're gonna make me cry! <laughs> poor penguin! Clock is ticking. Kira, welcome, welcome! How do we find Thank you for joining. Welcome to the stream. We just had to uh, take out one of our teammates. What are you doing? Why are you doing <gasps> Luke! I hear Luke! You, get the close you heard it too, right? I'm not crazy. I heard Scott Porter's voice! He better be okay. We better not lose him. Oh, I should probably pay attention and not get killed, right? Is Luke crying? Nice work. You know what you're doing. Or is Sarah with him? Now watch this. Hope you got a nice little addition to your arsenal. Jane's kind of badass. I like Jane. Dude. I'm kind of digging Jane. I think that Sarah is with Luke. Take out the knees first. Then put a knife in the back of its head when it's down. That's a good tip, Jane. All right. Get a look Not exploded, as in butt ejection, like everywhere. Oh, gross! I imagine that was quite the memory. At least he was okay, though. I was thinking that he like died. Like supposedly, if pigeons eat antifreeze, they'll like explode or something. So still disgusting. But not quite as, um, dark. Oh, was I not supposed to go yet? Was that preemptive? You down now, son. It is Sarah. Me and my sister laughed so hard. I'm sure the guy was pumped. Whoever the trainer was. I'm sure he was like, frickin' A. Whoops. I'm so distracted by penguins that I died. Oh goodness. Pick out the knees first, then put a knife in the back of its head when it's down. Kira, how are things going right, for you this week so far? We've got on deck. Thank you again for joining. I can't, I can't, I can't. We are currently um dying a lot. <laughs> so was I supposed to go over there yet? Maybe I should Ah. There's too many. We're not getting in while we're still hanging He wasn't as there. pissed off as the janitor. <laughs> I can imagine. I'm sure the janitor was less than excited. Oh jeez. It's gonna take some work to get over there. Penguin diarrhea. Let's see if we can oh, find goodness. There. <laughs> Your stories. Oh my word. At least you have so many to tell. That's awesome. All right, give me my ice pick back, fool. Darn walker. Okay, now we have to pay attention. This is where I died last time. Take him out of the knee. Yeah. Yeah, we got him. I learned some bad Spanish words that day. Oh, goodness. Oh, oh, there we go. I thought it was nice frozen trip. for a second. How's Emmy today? Emmy has abandoned me. That's a lot of walkers. Emmy is refusing to come in the house. So don't and waste your channel points on giving her treats right now, because she is not here. Um, How do we get she in? is out this window at the moment. Um, she's not alone. My dad is with her. There was a chipmunk in my car, so <laughs> she saw it and refused to leave my car. She was crawling under it, trying to get in it, like, trying to chase that chipmunk out and refused to go inside, refused to leave the car, so 
my lovely father is uh, with her and they are together trying to get the chipmunk out of my car, which I am very appreciative for. They told me it was a chipmunk, but I'm honestly not sold. I think they might be lying to me because I'm not terrified of chipmunks, but I am terrified of mice. I think it's probably a mouse because there was there's been mice in it twice before, at least. What do you think of that? I mean, I'm just making it up as I go along. That is a true mission. She is devoted. I wish I had taken a video of her like getting on her belly and shimmying under the car to go catch it. It was so cute. What am I looking for? See if you can find something to distract them. Something to distract them. Something that makes noise. Oh, I haven't talked to you, Brave. Yeah, I no, was talking about this strong. in my stream last night, but there was a mouse in my bed last week. In my bed. My asshole cat brought it up from the basement. It was a baby mouse and decided that it would be fun to just let it chill in bed. Callie. Callie is the one that brought the mouse into my bed. So, she might be being a good girl today, but she's still on my shit list. <laughs> I have not slept in my bed since, FYI. And it was alive. And she was just like, whatever. Laying down next to it. She laid it down inches from Emmy. Neither of them were bothered. And she like, oh, Callie betrayed her species as a cat. Like, really? Oh. Not a way to get points, Callie. Seriously. Oh. Just thinking about it. Like, I turned on... Callie doesn't usually meow. The other two cats meow a lot. But Callie doesn't meow. So when I heard her meowing that night, I was like, that's weird. What is it? So I turned the flashlight on on my phone, and I saw this dark shape next to her, between her and Emmy. And I turned my flashlight on, and I was like, are you effing kidding me? And I thought it was dead, because it wasn't moving. But it was just a baby. The adults will, like, run around and try to escape. The babies just, like, freeze in place. I was so mad at her. But... <laughs> oh, should I have done it like that? Should I have moved the truck first? That's good, but we need to keep it going somehow. Should I find the keys? Um, okay. Um, that's why my mother hates cats. Yeah, so they are allowed in the basement, typically. And I actually love it. There's a litter box room for them in the basement. So it, ooh, what's over here? Wasn't there something just there? Did I make that up? Is there not something there? I think I made that up. So yeah, in the basement, there's like a litter box room. So they can go in there and M can't get in it because she will indeed try to eat cat shit, which is yeah, fantastic, yeah, not disgusting so at all. Um, so we have a room, there's a little hole that the cats can crawl in and use the litter box, and then on the other side there's a door so I can go in and clean out the boxes or whatever. But it's in the basement, the basement gets water sometimes so it's kind of musty and it makes the smell kind of worse from the litter boxes and this house had never this was my grandmother's house that I bought when she passed away and she had never had a problem with mice except for in the basement and when I bought it I kind of opened up the basement so the cats could go in and out so the cats no longer have access to the basement because I'm hoping it will stop mice from being brought upstairs we'll see the cat's litter boxes are now upstairs, which I didn't want to do, because I liked the little litter box room that wasn't, like, in the house. But hopefully this will work better, because, I mean, I guess I can deal with it if it means no mice in my bed, right? Who wants mice in their bed? If you do, I have some serious doubts about you. That's all I gotta say. 
Alright, I feel like there's something I should be doing right now, but I don't really know what it is. Oh, there's a door. I should probably check out the door. We can get around this way, but if we don't get those walkers to move, we're not getting very far. Okay, so we can't go in there yet? Okay. My parents' attic is like an Amazon warehouse. There's a lot of stuff in my basement. I brought up 25 boxes the other day to get cleaned out. And like only 5% of the stuff that I brought up is going to stay in the house. And I'm very, very happy that that's the case. I'm a little bit of a pack rat. <laughs> Let's find a way to keep it on. All right. Yes, I heard you say that the first time, but I don't know how to do it. 25. Yeah, like, some of the boxes were just ridiculous things, too. Where? Alright. I'm totally missing something. I can't go in the trailer. I've looked at the dead walker so many times, it wouldn't let me search him. Oh! Duh! This game makes me feel really dumb. Can I just say that right now? Give me a hand. All right. Cheers. All right. You gotta pay attention. And then, not in the 25 boxes, there were three VHS players or DVD players that I'm not even sure why we're down there. There were, there was a big old-fashioned radio. There's a computer tower. It's working. I wouldn't have got that either. Right? Like, I feel like they maybe could have put another bit of dialogue or something in there that would have been kind of a hint. Oh, there's a lady walker in here. Ooh, and one behind us. Turn around, Clem. Get him, get him. Oh, me first. That's what Jane taught us. And he is down. Come on. Sarah, shut up. Crap. We gotta move it. Is this why they don't tell Sarah things? You still have DVD and VHS. You're such a retro queen. What do you have? I I do indeed. I still have a couple of VHSs. I've sold most of them. Um, come on, open. Open the door. My entire Disney movie collection is on VHS, and I'm really, really kind of a cheapskate. And I want them all on DVD, but I'm Help not gonna spend the money on a DVD when I already have the VHS because I feel like I'm buying something that I already have unnecessarily. So basically, all of my Disney collection is still on VHS, or I watched it on Disney Plus. You made a run for it, looking for help. Luke is alive. Look, he was out there, but we took care of him. Oh, you know. Sorry, Luke. Fuck. Fuck. Clint has strong legs. Seriously. Luke, where's Sarah? I, I don't know what to do about her. What's is she matter? like catatonic or something? You gotta help. But I have been building up my DVD collection. Actually, you can see behind me. See, it's just like I told part you. of my DVD okay. collection. It's not all of it. Just all the ones that would fit in this section of the house. Sarah, come on. Doing? All of the Can you get off? superhero movies, like Marvel and DC and stuff like that, are in a different part of the house. And Star Wars. You should sell them on eBay. You're sitting on Disney diamonds. Is that a real thing? Are they actually worth money? Because I definitely have some of like the Black Diamond collection movies. I'm really happy to see Luke again. What are we gonna do about her? Um, maybe she'll listen to me. Maybe we'll try. Me. Maybe. Did you see Hamilton? Listen, I haven't I watched it yet, but I want to so bad. Have you seen it? Is we it good? Stay. 
So we, we gotta get her up, or, or we gotta. I was gonna watch it with my friend, but apparently he has zero interest in ever hours. seeing it. So I'm probably gonna watch it by myself. <laughs> well. All right, Sarah, listen up, bitch. Sarah, it's me. You having an anxiety attack? Snap out of it, girl. You just can't help, okay? I've seen it before. Let's hug her. Maybe some no! physical contact? Nope, Shit. guess not. Maybe it seems like you're all alone right now. Did her dad you're die? Not. I don't remember. Yes, I am. What about Luke and Jane and me? We came I here don't remember. All of us in the group. We're your family now. I'll private message you later with the link. Yes, please. <laughs> I've heard so many great things about it. Oh, and I like history too, so I think I'll like it a lot. What, what about the skylight? And I like musicals. Oh we got. Clem. Aladdin no is going time. for 150 bucks on VHS. When everything started, what? I definitely have that. And I'm not working right now, so I could use the money. I just watched Aladdin the other day. I had a glass of milk. A brownie but you're still for here. breakfast because, because I'm totally an adult. And I watched Aladdin when I woke up. Because he wanted me to live. And it was a lovely morning. You because he wanted you to live. He would still want that. Yeah, so snap out of it, girl. Let's go, Sarah. Get up. Your broken glasses that are gonna do nothing for you. <laughs> Is there even a lens in one of them? Get to the skylight, now! I don't know if that's gonna be really helpful for her. What do you think? <laughs> What's going on what just there? happened to Luke? We're gonna need something to stand oh, he's on. hurt. Luke, get over here! Help me hold this! Disney Aladdin Diamond Edition what? goes for an See what eBay. you can find! Do I wanna know? Is it more than 150? Can we use that? Yeah, that would work. What? Oh, Wait, I don't know what the plan is. Not even gonna tell you right away. Okay, I'm gonna guess that it's more. Is it like 200? Okay, ready? On three. One, two, three! Boom! Come on. What are we doing? <laughs> I'm trying, I'm trying. Should I have got the other guy first or keep pushing? Go! I was trying, he told me to help you. Ten bucks. Oh. Ten bucks times ten. Oh. I need to spend some time on eBay and see what things are selling for. Oh, times a hundred? Luke, you first. We need you up top. That's insane. I need to spend some time on eBay and see what some of my childhood stuff is worth. Okay, come on. I have a bunch of those Clint. old school like Polly Pockets Sarah, too. To the ones that actually listening? came in the little like clampy things, like containers, no, and actually she fit in your pocket, go, not like the Polly Pockets they have now Don't that are big. You down too. Not again. Oh, I love that emo, Vandris. That's so cute. I like I that a lot. I can't, I can't. Daddy, I'm... Snap out of it, Sarah. Please. You can't save her, Clem. We have to go. Don't tell your dad. <laughs> I know about this. Hurry up. Um, slapper. I've been wanting to slap her. Let's be real. Clementine! Grab her! Come on. Is she gonna die anyway? <gasps> Jane better not die. I like Jane. Come on, Jane. Whew. We gotta go. Sarah. Come on. Yeah, Sarah. Come on. With movies, it's always when you slap them that they come too. I've been wanting to slap her since like the beginning of the conversation. <laughs> like cinematically, that's always the answer. If somebody's freaking out. Unless it's like a romantically tense scene and then they like kiss and it snaps them out of it, but 
Something usually happens. Returned to the meeting place. Don't tell your dad he'll sell your childhood and drive around in a uh, Bentley. <laughs> okay. okay. Look, I hate to ask this, but are we there, oh, Jess? What is this? <laughs> We're not far. Where are we going? Oh, the meeting place. Right, right, right. Please, Sarah. You've got to start trying. Yes, You're Sarah. You're not going to be okay. People won't want to help you if you aren't trying. But I'm not okay. Well, Just be try. okay. Can you do that? You gotta she try. just needs a little time, Clem. Leave her be for a bit. At least we got her out of there. I don't know about this. Seems the way she quiet. is. She's gonna cause problems. You're the one that said to give her a minute. What happened in there? When we went in there, you were ready to help, but then something changed. Look, I just I'd seen that kind of thing before. Was it her sister? Stick around for the bitter end. Sorry, I... I don't mean to sound harsh. Does that mean you'd turn on me if I was hurt or something? Was it no. her sister? I mean, Clem, I wouldn't have to. And just because you got her out of there today doesn't mean you saved her. Trust Cheers. Me. I tried to save Jamie too, but she gave up. Oh, Jamie must have been her sister. I don't know if my dad would go for a Bentley. I think he'd go for like a classic '50s style car. Go, I was the first one up on the roof. Like I had already made up my mind. Luke, actually, I'd probably ride around in it with him. <laughs> well, I can't forget it. Oh, are they gonna make a I love connection? My across four states, and every morning she'd say she wasn't getting up. So I'd convince her, or push her. Goddamn carrier! If, if he I pulls up in one, you'll know, right? This time, <laughs> Surprise! Walkers cornered us, forced us up to the roof, and then when they kept coming, I, I couldn't make her jump, couldn't oh. throw her. So I tried something else. I told her she could have what she wanted, and I left her there. Oh, that's rough. Jumped to the next building over by myself. Jane, I'm really sorry. That's hard, cause you have the guilt. But then again, you wanted to help. She killed me for a long time. But I finally realized that I'd put her on a forced march through hell. And all she really wanted was for me to let her go. How can you let someone go that Sarah easily when they're too. still alive, though? Jane? No regard for her own safety. Or ours. Sarah and Jamie aren't the same person. We don't know if she'll end up like that. That's rough. People don't change. Hey, sweetheart, thanks for keeping Disney Aladdin, Come right? On. Let's get back to your friends. Oh, I'll have to look at all of the others because I've got at least 30 at my parents' house that are all VHS. I've got some of them on DVD back here that people have given me as gifts. Or that are, um, <clears throat> bootleg. <clears throat> Son of a bitch. You found them. We did find them. No thanks yeah, to I'm you. A little amazed myself, to tell you the truth. If it weren't for Clem and Jane, well, Clem and Jane. I don't know what would have happened. Heck yeah. No cast. Thank you so much for the follow. Sarah, Welcome to the stream. How you doing, hon? We're trying to survive the zombie apocalypse right now. That's okay, sweetie. And talking about what that what old you childhood have? stuff glad you're here. is worth, like Disney on VHS. Wait, wait. wait. Where's Nick? <sighs> Nick is gone, Rebecca. Becca. How about we, uh... Go for a walk. Nice ring to it, yeah. Clem and Jane. Doesn't it? It kind of sounds like it goes Let's together. Give him some like space. Bonnie and Clyde. I have something I need to talk to you about. Clem and too. Jane in the apocalypse. No. Why do we have to talk to Bonnie? No. Because <laughs> she's obsessed with us. She's like trying to replace her kids with I us. I ain't gonna sugarcoat this. That baby's coming even faster than Rebecca's letting on. Oh, maybe not. But I was hoping you might know. Does Luke know anything about babies? Um, Has he? Kenny know. knows Mentioned about babies. Carlos teaching him anything? Kenny had a family. He could help. Where is he? He might. Oh, is Kenny gone? Oh, okay. He's in the tent. He went in there after he left. Said he needed a minute. I don't know. I think Kenny's gonna self-combust. What do you guys think? 
don't think he's doing well. Oh God, Kenny with a baby. I've seen him like this Sadly, before. the only one that has experience with babies is the one that uh. I think if it's just is me, Kenny, someone he knows well, you might be able to get through. Really, Bonnie? And I wouldn't really? ask you to do it if it weren't for the baby. Bonnie thinks that I'm the best person to go in and talk to him when he hates my guts because I'm responsible for him being alone. Hmm. And a cyclops now that he's blind in one eye. Questionable logic, Bonnie. Questionable logic. Not my first choice for a babysitter. Oh, wait, what do I have to do? Oh, left stick. Better than giving it to Krista. Do we even know where Krista is? Or what happened to her baby? We never found out, did we? They probably asked for a celery stick, not a lollipop. Penny, could you please come out? Now I really want a lollipop. Brave, you're always making what me hungry. The point? You know what it feels like to get beaten almost to death. I do know what it feels like, Kenny. Peaceful. And I know that you still need to get the fuck it up. It feels peaceful. It was like I was floating away, watching the whole thing happen to me. And then I woke up again. Nothing's changed. I'm vegan jokes. <laughs> every day. So brave. Don't I take it you're definitely a vegan, right? To... No peace. No rest. The punches just keep coming. My sister and boyfriend recently went vegan. Oh, interesting. Are you going over to their place for dinner anytime soon? Obviously, I ain't helping anyone by being here. That baby's almost here. So this is gonna last. Yeah, I, guess you I am definitely not vegan. I I grew up like as a kid. I always wished I could be a vegetarian because I love animals so much. Kill me yet, anyway. But like it must hurt. I would never be able to because I really like steak and stuff. Like I just I wouldn't be able to hack it, and I don't like veggie things that are protein so I would never survive as a vegan or vegetarian but we should see what's going I did on. recently try we went to the store and there was there's a meat shortage here in the US I don't know if that is elsewhere as well but there's a shortage on beef it's been difficult to get so we oh is she having her baby are you okay hey Panzer King welcome wet. good to That's see you feels. what's going on Rebecca's Did she just broke. break? <gasps> Her water broke. Oh, Christ. We should... I don't know what we should do. Oh, oh. fuck. And I have a hydrate. Coming, right? Kenny, thank God. I think the baby's coming. What do we do? All right, all right. Give me a second. No way can Rebecca travel like this. All right. So what we're going to do... We're going to do a quick break. I'm going to go find my Harry Potter wizard card and refill my drink because it is empty right now. Very sad. So that I can do the hydrate command and then I will come back and finish talking about veganism. <laughs> All right. So don't go far. We'll be right back. All right. Hold on guys. Thank you.
I feel like that was a pretty quick break, right? Not too bad. All right, I'm not on mute. Good, good. Okay, so we are back. I'm definitely not vegan at my sister's birthday. I never ate so much leaf. <laughs> All right, Panzer King, here is your hydrate command. And then as far as the vegan thing, um, I was saying we have a meat shortage here. Um, I don't know if that's other places as well or not, but there's been a big shortage with beef. And so at the store, things are like outrageously expensive or just not there. So tofu was only a dollar. So I actually got some and I tried this um, Nashville hot barbecue chicken type recipe for the tofu and it actually tasted not bad. I was stunned. I never thought that I would eat tofu. And it was, um, I'll have to try to find the recipe and post it, but I fed it to my parents too when they visited and they thought it was actually chicken. So that actually worked out pretty well. I've heard a lot of bad things about tofu and I don't think that I would eat it if it weren't like disguised as something else. But in that particular recipe, it was not bad. It was a pain in the butt recipe though, let me tell you what. Deniru, hello! Welcome! Yes, we are talking about tofu. I tried a um, Nashville hot chicken recipe with some tofu because it was only a dollar at the store and it was amazing. I fed it to my parents and they had no idea it wasn't chicken. A meat shortage. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe you're not having a meat shortage in the UK, but we've been having, there have been concerns about meat shortages here and the prices have definitely gone up, at least where I am. So we tried some tofu and it was, it was actually really good. De Niro, do you usually eat tof tofu? We were talking about some veganism and meat shortages and stuff like that. I think the meat shortages here were because of the pandemic. There were a couple of factories that usually produce the meat that had a lot of coronavirus cases and they shut down, so... Yeah. That's what happened. Um... <laughs> if we have a meat shortage in the UK, we should go cannibalistic. Well, I can imagine that there's probably several people who have a problem with that. <laughs> Including people who don't want to be eaten. De Niro. Yeah, we, I had never tried it before. We only tried it because it was a dollar at the store and the beef prices were insane. And I've mentioned before, I'm kind of a cheapskate. Um, I'm very frugal. That's a nicer word. Frugal but I don't like to spend my money. I like to keep it so I have it <laughs> in case of emergency or whatever. But I was a vegetarian for seven years. I like firmer tofu because it has the consistency of chicken. Yeah, I, I looked it up online. I got the extra firm kind and then we pressed it like overnight so it would be firmer. We're facing the same issue here. Yep, so unfortunately, their meat shortage is real. <laughs> the first to go would be the teens that use Eminem as an English teacher. <laughs> Oral gentrification. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Some of the things you come out with, Brave. Ugh. He's All right. right, what were we in the middle of here? She's gonna make a lot of noise. Oh, I forgot to ask. What did you guys think of the new pause screen? Did you notice that it has the chat on it now? I was really excited by that. Chickpeas are a great cheap source of protein. I have never had chickpeas. What do they taste like? Like, what is the texture? I'm such a picky eater, it's insane. So I'm not sure if I would like, like these things. I would like to try them, but I don't know if I actually would or could, because I'm so picky. And then I also have the new overlay. Let me, let me know what you guys think of that as well, if you feel like it. Um, the new webcam overlay and the overlay at the top. I don't know, I hope it doesn't interfere with the game too much. Like block anything too much so that it's annoying. Let me know if it is. 
So, and then for my birthday, my birthday is coming up, you guys. De Niro, you're a fellow Leo, so happy early birthday to both of us. Uh, my birthday is on the 10th. So I think I'm gonna do a birthday stream on either the 10th or the 11th, and I found a bunch of sound alerts today that I'm gonna use just for my birthday. They're all birthday related sound alerts. So I'm kind of excited. If you have any ideas on something fun to do for a birthday stream, then let me know. Cause so far all I've got are birthday themed sound alerts. So let me know. <laughs> um, hummus. No, I've never had hummus. I've seen it and it kind of scares me. My sister and her husband eat a lot of hummus. I also can't eat Greek yogurt. I know that's like kind of a jump from hummus to Greek yogurt, but my sister eats both of them and she's super healthy and likes organic stuff. And she eats a lot of hummus and Greek yogurt. And like, I can't do the consistency of Greek yogurt. So if that and hummus are related at all, then I don't know if I'd be able to eat it. Your birthday's on the seventh. So you've got two days. So happy early birthday. Trying to do a drunk stream. Panzer King, who was in chat earlier, I don't know if he's still here, mentioned that a drunk stream would be fun. So, do you think you're gonna do it? That could be fun. I mean, I'm doing a wine stream right now. I'm, I'm maybe feeling it a little bit. This is an awfully large mug to drink wine out of. And yes, we're drinking wine out of a Honeydukes mug because it's what we've got clean. We were talking about that a little earlier. I'm garbage at being a grown-up, so I haven't washed my wine glasses in like a month. So we're using whatever I have clean for wine and Walker Wednesdays. It's purely chickpeas. Oh, hummus is just chickpeas? Yeah, hmm, I don't know then. I'm skeptical of chickpeas. I don't know. Chickpeas. Be able to smell her too. Chickpeas and now lemon juice. No choice but to lock down and ride it out. I like lemon juice. Do first, <laughs> Whenever I was sick, my grandmother used Kenny, to make me a mix of on, water, lemon juice, some sugar, and honey. Right, right, sorry. Clean water and I used to have her make it for me even when I wasn't sick, just because I liked it. And we gotta get I haven't had that in years, too. though. That map shows a couple of buildings nearby. Maybe one of them could do the trick. All right, so we're at a Confederacy memorial. Is that where we are? The museum seems like it could be a good start. I'll go. Good idea. Bye, Bye Bonnie. You could go with her. See sure ya. Thing. I'll check the building by the river. Okay then. Amazing. Kenny, Grandmothers you, uh, are amazing. Stick with Rebecca, and I will check the perimeter for. I don't think I've had that since Sarah? a couple of years before Sarah? she passed away, and it's been quite Just a while. I should try Rebecca that again and, and okay. see if I still like it. Clem. Or maybe I don't want to, so I can like keep. The image in my I head or the memory hard, untarnished. I to I'd love for you to give me and Mike a hand looking at the museum, but I was thinking, hmm. how do we know Jane ain't just gonna take off? Maybe you should go with her, make sure she comes back. What do you mean by that? Do I have to make a choice? You know, I'd rather go like with Jane, but she volunteered to head off I don't want her to be offended if I go with her because she thinks I'm watching her. She's helped us so far. What do you guys think? Yeah, I feel no, like it's awkward. You're right. Maybe it's nothing. Just something to think about. Hmm. Okay, we're looking for warm blankets, clean water, oh, disinfectants. That all sound right? I want to go with Jane. Maybe I go with Jane. Better hurry and catch Just up. Just because then. I like her. All right, everyone. She's kind of a badass do. lady, you let's know. Be fast and let's be careful. Well, Panzer King, I never redeemed your channel point redemption. Let me take care of that right now for you. There we go. All right. So De Niro, we're like almost birthday twins. Definitely birthday buddies. It's very exciting. Okay. What am I looking for here? Anything in particular? I don't know. Oh, Jane's over there. So do I just go talk to her? Is she just like being emotional? 
What's happening? Oh, hey. Are you okay? Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah. So, De Niro, are you going to play a game that you, like, today. normally play and for your I birthday? Or are you going to play something different and special? Like, well, I don't know. I don't know what other people usually do for birthday streams. So, come on, partner. Let's go check out that deck. Yeah, partner, let's check like it out. Height. Oh, JJW is in here. Partner, don't let it get Chick to your head. These are a great Let's source go. of protein. Yeah, see, that's that's my problem. I, I don't feel like for. I like anything that would give break. me the protein that I would need. You know, like I'm so picky. My diet basically consists of carbs, pasta, potatoes, bread. That's basically what I eat. <laughs> Hey, wizard! Check this out. This gate's still locked, which means that hopefully. Thank you for the lurk. I really appreciate it. In the first place. Lots and lots. You have no idea. Who knows what could be in there? Do you think you can pick the lock? I should be able to figure All something right. out. Trying to get into this Maybe building. Maybe this will work. The nail file versatility uh -huh. is not overrated. Maybe we can bust the lock with that, huh? Huh? You know, uh. It wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand with this thing. See if you can like find me? something bigger. Oh. We might need to bust the mechanism. I was gonna say, I'm 11. Am I really a heavier hand? I don't know about that. So let's check out what's nearby. Find anything? No, not even trash. A poster? When will it end this cruel, cruel war? When will this cruel zombie apocalypse end? Why do we still have the jacket? Maybe we did find Carly's little uh, secret jacket store she kept in her back pocket. Maybe it wasn't so secret after all. Maybe everyone else just wasn't as vain as Carly. <laughs> What else are we... Oh, can we go through here? Maybe? No, I can look through the door, but I can't go through it. All right. Oh, there's a cannon. Can we roll the cannon into the door and open it? Bring out the big guns. Literally. Sorry, that was a really terrible I joke. I will see myself <laughs> out. Check the muzzle, Napoleon. <laughs> Thanks, oh. Bonnie, for this rainbow-colored tragedy. They fell in with some for real. It is not a jacket that I would wear at any point in real life. I can look at the infographic. That's exciting. Ow! Shit! You okay? Yeah. I think I almost had it. Keep looking. Own it. <laughs> I, I seriously have a weakness for puns and dad jokes. I love them so much and I have no idea why. I guess it's broken. They make me laugh so bad. I have a whole book of dad jokes, and it's fantastic. I love them. They always make me laugh, even if they're terrible. Your puns will soon be viral. <laughs> well, hey, then maybe it would be, wait. I hope what's in there is good. Can I help? Let's see if we can help her. If you can find anything to help me get this open. I feel like it would be awesome good. and scary Take to go viral. Because like with more not notoriety, like, you get more trolls, too. I don't know if I can handle trolls. I'm kind of shy. And I don't like to upset people. <laughs> but then maybe I could make streaming, like, a living. And actually do There's this full time and not worry river. about looking I for another I job. See a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca wouldn't make it in her condition. Keep it in mind. Is Jane, Jane? Jane? There's someone coming toward us. Oh, I was gonna say, that's another person, right? Who shit, is shit, that? Shit. He's coming this way. And who knows if he has friends nearby. Why is he coming up here? Who's that person? No I thought idea. it was a girl. Apparently it's a guy. But we should scope him out and see what he's up he to. He looks like Harry I Potter. Like having some strange he's got the glasses. Close to the others. I 
We've got enough on our plates with a baby coming. Maybe I can try talking to him. Good call. Let's try it. Oh, shit. Hide now. Yeah, you can handle it. Just say you have a protective dog with big teeth and they'll be like, tweet retracted. I think that would be a perfect situation. Just like, you're being mean, stop. My dog will get you. Fair enough, tweet retracted. That sounds ideal. <laughs> Alright, who is this Harry Potter dude? If his name is Harry, hey. I will laugh so hard. I just want to talk to you. I'm 11 years old. Relax. He does. He looks like Harry Potter. Do you understand? Like from me? the book covers. Yes. A very shaky Harry. I'm going to go. I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot anyone. Especially Malinka Devochka. Uh, little girl. Is he you Russian? don't have to shoot anyone. Just put the gun down. <gasps> Back up. Got you, got you. Put the bag down. Clem, make sure he doesn't have any other weapons in there. Okay. He seems scared. Maybe he's just a nice dude. No, I have no more guns. I swear. Lots of medicine. Anything? Is he a doctor? No. That's a serious stash of meds. Or a drug addict. Is no, no, that no, no, why no. he was so take shaky? Take whatever you want, but don't take the medicine. It's for my sister. My um. older sister, she's sick. Is it just you and your sister? No. I have many friends. In the woods. Sister or not, is Krista with them? That stuff. No, you are not nice people. You have already left me defenseless, and now you you take my sister's medicine. You are fury. Hey, we've got people who are suffering, who need this medicine. Luke's still a wreck after Carver. We could use Kenny's a mess. people. Rebecca's in pain. We could use medicine for our people, but I don't want to steal it Clementine, from someone else. We need who that needs suffering it. just as much as yours. You are not special. Oh fuck! Clementine, yes. I don't want to make this decision. You worried about your sick sister. Please don't make my sister suffer. She has been through enough. Oh yeah? Well, I'm gonna return the bag. Junkie. You know what that word means, oh, huh? No, no, I'm. I'm telling the truth. I swear upon my own life. I chose to return the bag. You're not taking them. I'm not robbing anybody. Was that bad? Just let him go. Oh, push it. Thank you, Clementine. Thank you. I feel like I should have kept it, but I don't want to be mean. My moral compass is too strong. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? You don't have to do this. Jane, what are you doing? What are you doing, Jane? Don't shoot don't Harry you Potter. Ever come around here again. I don't care if you do have some sick sister. The next time I see you, you won't just be walking away. Go. Jane's scary. Sport ball? Did the bag say sport ball on it? Weird name. Can't believe I've gotten into this mess. Threatening some stupid kid? I thought we were just gonna talk to him. I needed to make sure he didn't come back here again. I think he was Russian. He definitely sounded Russian. Then again, I'm not familiar with all of the accents from that area. Get this place open, and we need to get moved in ASAP. I would like to try to work on adding a Russian accent to my repertoire, but uh, the few times I've tried, it has not gone very well. It sounds like I'm trying to do a very offensive accent of a different ethnicity, and I'm not trying to offend anyone, so I'll work on that some more before I break it out. And hopefully Clem, it won't Clem, hey, be offensive. Clem, hey, that observation, Dick? I was just checking on Rebecca and Kenny. They said they hadn't heard from you in a while. I don't guess there'd be much, but Jane seems pretty resourceful. Jane we and I met were a trying stranger. to open a gift shop, and a stranger showed up. What? Oh, puppy! Oh, baby! Well, 
you want to be on TV? Come here. Come here. No, come over here, baby. Come here. Oh, she doesn't want to come up. She's too hot. She's been busy chasing stuff out of my car. Do you want to come up and say hi? Say hi to the people? No? She wants to be antisocial today, I guess. What are you doing? Come here. Come here. There we go. Yeah, say hi to the people. Come on. Come on. Yes. Yes, good girl. Good girl. Did you catch the chipmunk? Brave wants to know. Did you catch it? Oh, you want your bone back? Okay. <laughs> that was a good girl. She wants butt scratches now. Yeah. Yeah. It was a good baby. She says hi. I don't know if the chipmunk is caught or not, but that bone is technically not allowed in the house, so it doesn't scratch my floors. But you know what? She's cute, so it's okay. Whoops. All right. I'll take that as a yes. I hope she caught it. Well, Glad you're okay. I don't want the chipmunk to be hurt, but I don't want it in my car. Still up there now? You know, yeah, she's conundrum. Gift shop open. You know, I can't figure her out. I mean, she really lays it on the line, but at the same time, she doesn't show you anything that counts. I'm still not sure what to think about she's her. She's such a cute girl. She's strong, and she's been helping us. But she's you know we're talking about you? Yeah. Maybe. No, she just wants to look out the window. I'm definitely starting to think we might need to branch out. What do you mean? Jane seems like the kind of person who gets tempered by hardship, you know? Okay. But when I look at Kenny now, he just, he seems broken. Broken well. people get reckless. I know you got a history with him. Look, I think he's a good guy. At least started as a good guy. Are you any better? Is I think he's or right, or but I don't want to admit mean. that he's right. Am I a bad person I if I give up on Kenny? And that means picking the right side. I don't know. I don't know. Like, I feel safe with Luke, need to tell the but I'm about the deck. pretty yeah, sure it's just because he's voiced by Scott uh, Porter, so it's probably not a great life choice. But Kenny... Kenny was with us almost from the beginning. Almost. Not as long as Lee. Don't get on the cuckoo could you train. <laughs> I know, I feel like if I ever met Scott Porter in real life and I was like, yeah, your voice made me feel really safe in the Walking Dead game. He would just immediately be like, okay, you're a psycho stalker. Clementine. What'd you find? The building around back has an observation deck. So is Kenny not pissed at me anymore? It's coming so much faster than I thought. I told you, you're getting yourself all worked up over nothing. There's a room up there that might be good for when Rebecca has the baby. Jane's trying to get it open. Sounds good. As soon as Mike and Bonnie are back, we'll Not go. if he met me. <laughs> I loved Scott Porter on Heart of Dixie. Glad you made it back. And I actually saw him recently on Friday Night Lights, which oh, is where I think he got his start. I'd be like, you're Luke Wilson's younger brother, right? <laughs> Oh my gosh, I still can't get over the fact that we were calling him Luke Wilson, and then his name was Luke. Alvin would be that was insane to me. Right As if that him. happened. I hope you're right. I know it's a waste of time. What time is it for you right now, Brave, in the UK? I said to him, things I should have talked to him about. How am I ever going to do? We'll help you keep him. your baby safe, we ma'am. Help you keep the baby safe. Oh yeah, you're a good kid. We'll try. Time. We I'm will glad try. Be there to watch out for this baby. Ugh. Oh shit! I got Is this. the baby coming now? We ain't seen. We might be having a baby. And I'm not saying I don't trust him, but I'd appreciate it if you went and checked. Coming up, up on to 10 p.m. Oh, okay, yeah. that's not too bad. I was thinking it was like 1 a.m. there, and I was like, holy crap! I would need my beauty sleep if I were you. Are you okay, Kenny? Sure. Why wouldn't I be? Because your life is shit? 
Bang. All right. Talking to Rebecca. Craig old lady. But I didn't think it would hurt like this. Isn't that what childbirth is? Just pain? Be prepared, lady. All right. What else are we looking at here? All kinds of stuff to look at right now. You're still hung up on the extra from Disney Aladdin, Kenny, just saying. <laughs> you know what I felt like watching yesterday? I had like the strongest urge to watch Hercules from Disney. Probably because I have all of like the Disney soundtracks on my Spotify and I was listening to some of the Hercules soundtrack yesterday. It's a solid soundtrack, that's all I gotta say. I hope one of these buildings is safer than out here. It is, it's such a good movie. Observation it's so there. underrated. Like I feel like it came out after like the Disney the Renaissance the movies. Museum that everyone is just automatically like, oh yeah, they're amazing. Right so it's kind of like underrated and people don't know about it as much, but it's so good. Hey, Sarah. Meg you know, is freaking awesome. Going to leave me. I loved her as a kid. I was like, that girl is sassy and she's awesome. Of course not. Luke tried really hard to get you to come with him. How come you didn't? I bet you could easily do an East Coast Danny DeVito. Did you want me to? Just her song is fire. Dad. It is. I love that song. I always try to sing her part and the muses part at the same time, which doesn't usually work out for me, but it's fun to try. I always end up out of breath. Sarah. I love Disney a little bit too much. No, he isn't coming, right? And it's so Sarah. funny that all of the princesses are like so commercialized, but Meg is so freaking awesome. And she gets like nothing. And she's a cool lady. James Woods makes me laugh just by talking. He was perfect in that role. Like literally, if they do like a live action Hercules or something like they did everything else, then oh my God, I don't even know. Like if they, did a live action and didn't have him as Hades, like, how would you even watch it? You know? I don't know. I haven't seen a lot of the live actions because I'm afraid. Because I don't want my, um, my feelings of the cartoons to be tarnished. Is that what I'm supposed to do? Follow Mike and Bonnie? I don't know. I guess that's what we're gonna do. really, really slowly, I guess. All right. So if it's like almost 10 p.m. there, it's almost 5 p.m. here, there must be a five hour time difference, especially in Family Guy. Who is he in Family Guy? I don't think that I hey, knew that he was on Family Guy. I thought you went with Jane. Roro, I missed she that. Didn't take off, did she? Take off? Why do you think she'd take off? We found a place for Rebecca to have the baby. An observation deck with a gift shop. It's way up high and pretty safe from the wind. Oh, that's great. Just give me like ten more minutes to search around. He doesn't want to go back empty handed. He played himself. I, I just really? Want to help. I must have missed that episode. I used to watch that in college a bit, but honestly, I have not seen it in years. I watch this side, you watch the other. Deal. What are we looking at? A cannon. Another big gun. These don't work anymore. Nah, they're just for show. Be handy though. Also, really loud. And me is wandering around very discontentedly, like she wants to get out and go after another chipmunk. You'd think she'd be tired. Why aren't you tired, baby? You think maybe they say that stuff about water and blankets just to get people out of the way? 
I'll have to look up that Family Guy episode. Ayers, huh? I also Looking haven't seen the Star Wars themed no. Family Guy episodes, well, I and I really want to. I've heard they're decent. <sighs> Good point. And I feel like I'm so obsessed with Star Wars. I should probably see the Family Guy episodes, you know? There will be plenty more chipmunks tomorrow, sure Emmy, right? Here. Every morning when we go out for her morning walk, she has to check all of her spots Empty. where she's seen chipmunks before. She has caught chipmunks. She's caught a chipmunk twice. Not the same one. Unfortunately, no, one of the chipmunks so did not make it, Unless you want some broken which makes me sad. I, sure hope we can find something to I love back. animals so much. I don't necessarily like want them in my house or like my car, but I don't want them to die, you know? But one of them, she she thought she was playing with it, and um, I, tell you, I, sure I think her idea of playing was a little too rough for that chipmunk, so he did not make it. The first one she caught, she like put her yeah, paw on it sure and it got stuck and I don't think she knew what to do so she like looked at me and lifted her paw up and it ran away. <laughs> the funniest thing I saw, so we were at my parents house and they have a, a fireplace place. built out of cinder blocks behind their house and it's actually really cool. It definitely is not as like redneck as it sounds but it looks really cool and she likes to check it out because a lot of mice and chipmunks like to hide in it and so she stuck her nose in there one day when I took her out while we were at their house and she would not leave so I was like oh there must be a chipmunk in there and honestly I was trying to get her away from it so that she would be so that the chipmunk could get away safely because I want the chipmunk to be okay before it starts getting warmer and I, give it to Rebecca. I shined my That's flashlight in there, or shone I'm my sure flashlight in there, and I could not see the chipmunk. I guess you've already got well, it had climbed up idea. onto like the cooking level, I so bad. and I, I literally I watched. I wish I had my camera so I could record that this happened. This chipmunk ran out, you finally opened your eyes about ran across the cooking surface, That's leaped off, yeah. jumped onto her butt, and used her butt as like a launch pad to jump off onto the ground and escape. Like, that stuff only happens in cartoons. I swear to God I saw it happen. Like, pinky promise that I am not making this up. I laughed for hours. I can't believe that actually happened and that I saw it. Find anything yet? Not really. And she like turned and looked at me like, what just happened? And I was like, um, how did you not notice that it just jumped off your own butt? Like, what? <laughs> it was insane. Alright, what are we supposed to be doing here? I've been talking too much. You guys make me talk too much and not pay attention. <laughs> we'll go to the ticket booth, see what's up there, right? We'll check it out. And we'll take another sip while we're at it. Cheers. So the ticket booth is closed. Nothing but junk in there. Trust me. So he must have looked already. This Mike guy. But we're gonna check again anyway, I guess. Oh, can we get in this way? Let's do it. What's that? Over here. Do we find something? Some supplies, maybe? Water. Bottled and clean. That's just what we need. Did Mike do a quick a man's quick glance? <laughs> it's locked. I used to work with a girl that would get so frustrated whenever she asked her husband yeah, to look for yeah. anything. She would always you know, say, no, small, you don't just look with your maybe, eyes, you look with your hands, to too. Thing. You have to move stuff. I could try to pry it open some more, but I don't know if that'll help much. All right. Honestly, All right. though, I'll go. Thanks, Glenn. I fall under that just stereotype. <laughs> I am guilty. So apparently I'm a man, I guess. 
I fall under man's stereotypes way too often. Wow, that's a really narrow thing to fit under. I'm stuck. Okay, maybe I push from... Ooh, walker. So that reminded me because it kind of jumped me. You guys have mentioned in previous streams that you think that I should try Resident Evil. And I'm really considering that. Well, um, that happened. I think that it would be fun. Guess I'm not quite as small as I used to be. And you're tough for your size. I have discovered scare alerts are a thing. Not sure if I want to mention that because I'm a chicken and I might pee myself. But I might try to start Resident Evil with scare alerts enabled. So, Let's get this we could chill and do some scary streams, and you guys could spend channel points to scare the crap out of me. <laughs> JJW thinks that sounds great, apparently. Thanks a lot, JJW. <laughs> no, for real, though. If you guys think that sounds like fun, then I, I'm probably going to do it anyway. But if you guys think that it sounds yeah, like fun, pretty, let yeah. me know when I'm uh, it's all right. even more likely to do it, I guess. I know it looks like a lot, but we could all go through this pretty quick. Carver was crazy, but at least his shelves were always full. What do you mean? Nothing. Nothing. Just I'm I'm a huge chicken and I've always avoided horror anything horror, but Rebecca. I don't know. Even mm -hmm. when The Walking Dead scares me or Gears of War scares me, playing some of these scarier games with you guys, like supporting me, has actually been really fun. So I just I think it could be a cool thing. Figure making us me. Oh, we're gonna kill this raccoon. That makes me sad. Not like I mean. I've gotten really into the Resident Evil games the last couple months. Been going through them all. Some are horrible, but there are a lot of great games. So should I start with the first one and like play through them all? Don't let it get away. That's what I was thinking about doing. But let me know if you think that's a good idea or not. Cause I don't know how the games are. I've never seen a Resident Evil movie. I've never played a game. I know nothing about He's it. Coming your way. Block him. This poor raccoon. I don't want to kill it. Oh, oh, shit. Shoot. Dang it. I'm kind of glad he got away. Not with the walkers out there. <gasps> it has babies. Let it free. Be gone, little raccoon. I'm even hungrier than I was. Be free before. with your babies. How'd I get to a place where I'm I am sort of glad it got away. Raccoon. Well, I'm sort of glad it got away. It had a family. Yeah, me too. Come on, let's just get this back to Rebecca and the others. I would be horrible in the apocalypse. If I saw that raccoon and saw that it had babies, I'd be like, yes, I'll starve. Go ahead, you live. I just love animals so much. It's probably not that healthy, but it's okay, right? It's okay. You're telling me your arms ain't tired? Nope. He's a strong dude. I do this all day. Hey, Throg. Shit. Welcome. Shit. Oh, God. Wine Walker really Wednesday is going good. Okay. This okay. week we've got uh, oh, wine and a honey duke oh, smug because oh, no. oh, I still God. have not washed my wine glasses from several weeks ago. Clem! Clementine! So cheers! Shit, walkers! No Batman this week. The Batman mug is also dirty because <laughs> I'm a garbage grown-up and I don't do my dishes like I should. Don't tell on me. Kenny! So honeydukes this week. I think the only mug that I have left that's clean is a Disney princess one. So next week you might be seeing a Disney princess mug. Unless I do oh some God, dishes. There's so many. Mike, get Sarah. They've remade the first three beautifully. I would start with them. RE4 is great. I'd skip five and six. Seven is phenomenal, but more frightening than the others. Ooh. Okay. So the remakes of the first three. And then four, but skip five and six. And then seven is good. Alright, I'll have to keep note of that. Because I would love to... It would be cool to do it, like, at night, too. Like, wait until it gets dark and get all cozy with a blanket and stuff. And then let you guys scare the crap out of me. 
remake is great. I own it for as a masterpiece. Okay. I definitely think that's something that I'm gonna do. I don't know if I want to start it, it like soon. Like maybe start it on my birthday for like the special birthday stream or maybe wait until next, like the week after my birthday. I'm not sure. I still haven't totally decided what I want to do for my birthday stream to make it special. Maybe I'll just play Skyrim because I love it, but then I'll have like the birthday sound alerts and stuff. I don't know. If you guys have ideas or anything that you want to see, let me know. I am open to suggestions. <laughs> Jesus, Clem, it's just not. They're a um, thing. What's going on? Well, uh, they're making a love connection. I mean, in here. I'm a little bit jealous, Luke. Is what that ridiculous to admit? Like, what the hell, man? On? We got God knows how many walkers out there. I knew they were gonna make a love connection. Hey, I called it, on, right? Right? Just tell me what's going Brave, on. you were here, you know. You heard me call it. You're a reckless fucking moron. I'm reckless. You know, you got a lot of nerve, Kenny. The walkers are right behind us. We have to keep them from getting up here. There's still the stairs. I'm not very happy with Luke. <laughs> Fuck. I'm Poor sorry. Jane right now. Shit. Right over here. Shit. Not cool, guys. They're coming up the stairs. Here. We should. You want to help. Get out there and keep the walkers off us. Yeah, Luke. Been here before. They can't rush us on the stairs. Ooh. Shoot them before they get to us. I don't know what to do. I guess I'll ask. Whatever you can. Who do I help? I guess I'll help kill walkers. I don't know that I'm much good with babies. I'm 11 years old, so. Alright. We can't let them up here. Alright, let's get some walkers. Boom. 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 Oh yeah, she's having a baby. Just drop an alert. Oh, thank you so much. It's there very much appreciated. Thank you very, very much, Rob. I'm happy for anything that you want to give. A lurk, I am very happy with. It's more than I could ask for. You're showing how it's done. Hell yeah! 11 years old and I'm shooting these people under the table, if that makes sense. I don't know if that expression works that way. Um, what about this? It's too light. We need something heavy. I'm still kind of like salty that he and Jane got something oh, no, going on. Like Luke, I thought we had something special. I know Clementine's eleven, but come on, you and me, man. Ready? You think you know someone? Oh shit! <laughs> Darn it! I was too emotional over a man and my world turned to shit. If that's not a life motto, then I don't know what is. <laughs> All right. Focusing, focusing. Okay, that was too light. We gotta go with this. And now I have to pay attention and not die. Come on, come on. Let's go, Luke. We're doing it, we're doing it. Oh, are they still breaking through? Ah, it glitched! Oh, it's shit. hot, oh no! What the fuck is going on out there? Well, that kinda worked, but also kinda didn't. Get back, get back! Oh, shit! <gasps> Who fell? Gee! Sarah, hang on! Fuck, fuck, hurry! I can't hold on! <laughs> Oh dear. Clem, come on. Am I choosing? Take my hand. Am I choosing? No, 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 no. Could I have saved them both? Oh my god. Do you think that I could have her save Sarah? Oh shit. I don't know. What the fuck is going on out there? Are they well, like will they both die? Maybe I should try to have her save Sarah? I don't know. This is such a hard decision. Okay. Maybe we'll try to have her save Sarah this time. 
Jane, save Sarah! Are you crazy? There's no way she's getting out of that. Pull me up. It's suicide. Just pull me up. We can't leave her without even trying. Just go! I might need more wine to handle this. Am I making a bad decision? I don't know. I don't know. Oh my god, I'm so stressed right now. Okay. Is she you have to listen is to she me. too stuck? Sarah, shut up. So Sarah is done. I guess I tried. I'm so sorry, Claire. I tried. Whew. It just wasn't enough. Thank you for going down there. Okay. Alright. Collecting myself. Push. Damn. Oh shit. They're climbing up. I really Let's, wanted to save gonna them both. Here. Does this shit ever end? No, clearly it doesn't loop. We need to break the rest of the deck. She's right. She's right. Drop the whole deck. Break it, break it, break Drop it. The... Are you fucking crazy? How are we gonna do that? I don't know. Just look around. I'm breaking it. I don't know. Just get it done. Hack the support cable. Oh. Ain't gonna work. Oh. It's too thick. Okay. Can we break that part? Maybe. Maybe. Look. That'll work. I did not expect Sarah to die that way, did you? You guys have played this game though, right? So maybe you did expect it. Mike is a tank. Like, hell yeah, Mike. Come on, Come on, man. Go you. Ooh, they gone. We resourceful. We dropped that deck. Hell yeah. Anybody watch Jenna Marbles? <gasps> oh, hell yeah! Oh, there's a baby. Is the baby not alive? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. What is happening right now, you guys? Did the baby live? Are we all just chilling up in a tower now? Like Rapunzel? That was heartbreaking for a moment there with the baby. What? Hey, Clementine. Hey. How's he doing? He's perfect. Who's a perfect little man? Who's the most perfect little man in the whole world? What are we gonna do now? That was. We can't stay here. Whew, my Can my we? uh. I've got my heart rate. It's getting colder. It's way, way, way up right now. That's all I can say. Think of something. Just not this second. I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh, she. I just wish I could get warm. Clem, why don't you give her that coat we found? Is she not gonna make it? Are we gonna end up with the baby, but not her? Not the color. Like with Lori and Judith. You think I care about that? Do you? want to hold him? Not really. I don't know how. It's easy. Just keep him close and support Babies his are so fragile. Like, keep it until it can hold its own head up and then maybe we'll talk. That's how I feel. <laughs> there you go. You're a natural. Look at I'm you. 11. Like a big Back sister. off with that. <laughs> I don't think she's gonna make it. You both should rest. Why is she coughing? Especially you. 
When's the last time you slept, Kenny? How about two years ago. I'm fine. Plus, somebody's gotta watch you while Mama gets your beauty sleep. You never forget that smell. I don't know if Becca's gonna make it. But I feel like Kenny is gonna, like, latch on to the new baby. What do you guys think? Do you think that might be a problem? I don't know. What's Jane doing? Are you spying on us? Ah, oh, shit. What are you doing? Listen, I'm sorry. Is she leaving? I've gotta go. <gasps> no, you can't go. Go. Go where? You have Just to stay with us. Away, okay? You know, Jamie, Sarah, I'm not gonna stick around and... Jane, watch it happen to you too. Get over yourself. You know the score. But Jane, come I on. You believed in no, me. that's not allowed. Exactly, Jane. Leave. You cannot leave. It's I forbidden. Give it enough time, and everyone's forbidden. You have to stick with us. Listen, when the shit hits the fan, because it always does. Remember that you can make it on your Luke own. is going to be super sad and pissy, which is going to make, make me angrier. Don't, yourself, don't let them drag you down with them. You don't owe them anything. Jane, just don't leave. They'll make you feel like you do. Like it's all one happy family. Can can I go with you? No, you can't. It's not how this works. She's just a lone wolf. I don't want you to be a lone wolf. I want you to stay with us. Be like Daryl. Learn how to be you with take a group. Care of yourself. I mean that. Damn it, Jane. Here. Thanks. Yeah. Good luck surviving alone. I, uh... I gotta go. Why does she have to leave? Strength in numbers. Everybody always leaves. Ooh, I got some real tears going there. I can fake cry, and sometimes when I like work my face up to it, they just start coming. It's weird. Uh, thought you'd be asleep by now. You okay? Yeah, your girlfriend just left Luke. It's nothing, Luke. Don't worry about it. Yeah, don't okay. worry about just it. Cause I'm mad out. at you. <sighs> Temperatures dropping. We're low on food. I think we gotta stay put for a while. For Rebecca and the baby. In our little Rapunzel tower. I'm as soon as it gets light, Jane and I should go explore. See if we can find some place to scatter. Jane's gone, so you can explore with me. Hmm. How you like that, Luke? What? Jane left. For good. She'll what? be back. What? Will she really? Are you serious? She didn't say anything about leaving to me? What the fuck? I hope she comes back. Damn it! Keep it down. It's the Sorry. Clem and Luke show now. Hell yeah it is. No more Clem and Jane. Clem and Luke. Which sounds kind of like an STD. Clem and Luke. We're going to ignore that though. We're just going to pretend it sounds good. You two roll around like fucking teenagers. I made a mistake. You guys are both acting like jerks. All you guys do is fight. Yep. Look, I'm sorry. Okay? I fucked up. But you know what, Jane? Sure did. And Jesus Christ, I needed it, okay? I mean, look around you. And he's okay, everything hole, right? Shit. So forgive me for one day enjoy one moment of something Stop else. Stop yelling. Fine. No. But this baby, he's what matters now. Got it? So get your shit Honey, together. Where's my baby? Is everything all right? Everything is fine. We're gonna need a good place to raise him, which ain't here. We gotta push on. North, mm. get to Wellington. He That's really still shot. wants to get There's to Wellington, huh? The river. It might be safe there. I don't know, this tower seems cool. Stop on the way. Kenny! I'm sorry. Kenny's totally gonna try to take over this baby. Clem's got a point. That could be... Inside town. voices, right. And not that far from here. A whole lot better than here, anyway. Looks like that's our best bet. We need to get on the road. I think Kenny's gonna convince possible. himself we that it's his baby. Whoa. Whoa, what are you talking about? 
Rebecca needs rest. A few days at the least. Oh, is it snowing? Got that baby formula. And won't help the rest of us. <sighs> what about shelter? We'll freeze out here. Luke's right. She I needs to rest. We should wait a few She days. does need to rest, Maybe but we should leave. We don't want to push Rebecca too hard. Just give me a day or two, Kenny. I'll be fine. This is a mistake. But we should all try to it get It probably some is, but I don't know. The decisions are too hard. Ah! I suck at decisions. If you haven't gathered that from the last few weeks of playing The Walking Dead <laughs> and me complaining about all of the decisions. <laughs> Hey, Bex. It's gonna be all right. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Why is she coughing, though? Baby possessive disorder. Seriously. He thinks that baby's his. Is this the end of the chapter? That chapter seemed like it went by so fast. Okay, it's not the end. Okay. I was going to be kind of sad if it was the end. Or maybe it is. I don't really want it to be, though. I'm having fun. It's cold. We probably should have left when Kenny said. Row, row. I guess it's a good thing we kept that ugly rainbow jacket from Bonnie. Oh, dear. You all right? I don't think Becca's going to make it. What do you think? We all are. I don't think the odds look very good. Keep going. Are we in Georgia still? No, we're in Virginia now, right? I think we're in Virginia. We should have left right away. His moans keep him warm. We could have found more food. Molly's bitching and moaning. warm days ago. We did the right thing. She was in no condition to move. She's worse now. We can still turn back. That's not an option. Everybody hang I in there. I don't think Beck is going to make it. I think we're going to have a baby, but no baby mama. You don't even listen to anyone else. You just go on barking orders. You got to lighten up. Okay, you're pushing them too hard. I'm just doing what has to be done. Like all Arguing isn't helping. By arguing. Well, don't forget you agreed with me about waiting to leave camp until today. Way to be a five-year-old, Luke. Uh, uh, oh. Can we just like carry Rebecca? Rebecca, let me take the baby. I think she is gonna take the big sleep. He's okay. I've got him. No. I don't think you this is gonna go very oh, well. Back off, Kenny. She said she doesn't want you to take the baby. Don't be weird about it. Okay? Luke, shut up. I ain't being weird about it. Yeah, you kinda have been. Oh my god. Not just right now. I don't know what to say, so I'm just don't not gonna say anything. I was just trying to help. Kenny is being kinda weird. But Luke also could just not say anything. Is this a stranger? Who the fuck are you? What's going on? Yes, listen. Arvo? Arvo? Jane and I met him on the observation oh. deck. Before everyone else came. So maybe it's a good thing? That's the guy. Can let him keep his medicine? You know this son of a bitch? Well, what's he want? He doesn't look like much. He has a sick sister. They might be Russian trouble. Harry Potter. Seriously. All right. He does, though. He looks like Harry Potter. He's got the blue eyes. Well, I guess he has green eyes in the book, so. Hello. Blues from Your the name movie. Is Clementine. Yes. Yes. Hi, Arvo. These are your friends. One of my cats is crying. Me now. Not like before. All of you Why you help. cry, cat? Oh, shoot. What was I supposed to say? What is it that you want? Whoops. I need, uh, uh, things for bandages. I need bandages. You need bandages. Are you hurt? No. Is it the timid one? Probably. Did he just set us up? Arvo. He is Russian. I think. I recognize one word anyway. I told them you are the ones who robbed me. 
They think it's funny that you're just a little girl. Robbed? And they want you and your friends to put down the guns, so we can take your things. We didn't rob you. Whoa, whoa, hang on. What the hell? Why get excited? I gave his stuff back. Podожди, подожди. What would you want us to give you? I can't. Sorry, Clementine, but we are not here to make deals. Buriko is saying that we will take everything. I don't think so, boy. This could be easy for you. Arvo, скажи, чтобы они опустили оружие. All of you, just put your guns down. This will be fine. We have a baby. Yeah, shut up, dude. You have a baby with you? We do. Не крутничковый ребенок. So fuck off. Hi, kitty. Come on. Come say hi. Hi. Drop that now or I'm gonna fucking Please. shoot it. I'll do it. No. Drop it. Drop it. Don't fucking don't move. I said don't move. Everybody is cool. This 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 is Oh! Oh, she turned! No! <gasps> Should I have not shot? Oh my god, what happened? Did I just fuck up? I don't know. Oh my god, that's how it ends? No! I don't want it to end that way. But yes, this is Cole. He's a good boy. He he's the socially awkward one. But he's so so sweet. He's such a good boy. He wants love so so badly, but he's also very very afraid of it. <laughs> he's always like, "Yes, please pat me. Please, I want to be with you." But wait. Wait, this is so much. I don't know. That's like basically his personality, and he's a huge chicken. He's afraid of everything. And yet, he's a big boy. He is quite large. We had to make sure that the kitty doors for like the litter boxes and stuff were big enough to accommodate him. He's not as big as my baby Costello, but he's a pretty big boy. And I don't know why he's so timid because I've had him since he was a kitten. So it's not like he's ever been abused or anything. He's just really socially awkward. <laughs> But he loves love so much. He's a good boy. And I'm his favorite person, which makes me feel kind of good. But he's a chicken. Yes, he is. He's not as big as my cat Costello, though. My cat Costello, I had him, I got him when I was 13 or 14. So he still lives at my parents' house, but he is he was 22 pounds at one point i think he's down to 19 or 20 now but he's not even like overweight he's just a big big boy and he's fluffy but costello is a tuxedo cat so he's mostly black with the white he's a very regal looking fellow but costello is well cole is almost as sweet as costello costello is my main man but Cole, you are right up there. Yes, you are. I love my boy kitties. The ladies and I clash a little bit, but me and my gentlemen kitties, yeah, we tight. Right, Cole? Yeah, good boy. All right, so how many left Sarah at the trailer park? 41% of us saved her. 51.9% refused to steal from Arvo, which clearly kicked us in the butt. 46.3% volunteered to crawl through the ticket booth. 54.8% held the baby. 45.2% shot Rebecca. I'm curious what would have happened if I had called for help instead of shooting her. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know. Like, would it have been better? Like, did everybody just get shot and die? Like, I really want to start the next one, but I also don't. Oh no. 
Oh dear, hold on. There we go. I had to pause the sound because I'll get a DMCA strike for stealing music or whatever. Oh my goodness. So, one more thing that I would like to show you guys. I have a new, another new screen. Um, where is it? Hi! I have another new screen, this one right here, for if, I don't know, if I'm not playing a game and there's nothing going on and I want to see chat as well, so... I don't know, I spent my morning, I, I was supposed to spend my morning organizing VODs and doing things on YouTube and whatnot. Oh, there's another kitty here. Let me see if I can show you her. Hi, Whiskey. Hi. Yeah, are you a good girl? That was Whiskers. She is actually the oldest cat here. She's 11, 12, 13? One of those. I'm not entirely sure. But she... She's a crotchety old lady. She, um... I would pick her up, but she, she does not like that at all. Not a fan. So I won't. I'll leave her be. <laughs> Partially to save my own skin so she doesn't claw the fuck out of me. But she does love some attention. Callie's the only one who didn't make an appearance today. What the hell, Callie? Alright, though. We are finished with that chapter so I guess we are done with Wine and Walker Wednesday. Brave I think that you usually peace out by now so I'm pumped that you got to stay for the whole thing today. I know that it's much later over there for you. So I have a very wee bit of wine left so a final cheers. And I will thank you so much to everybody that came out today. Let's see real quick if there's anybody to raid real fast. Um, I don't know. Who is live right now? Let me look. Let's check it out. Isn't that from a movie? I think it is. Check it out. Oh, it is. It's from Oliver and Company. Um, who is it? The little Chihuahua. Is his name Tito? I think it's Tito. I think so. I think that Tito is um, the one who says, check it out. All right. So bear with me a second here. Let's see if we can find someone that might be live. That would be fun to check out. I really want to start the next chapter, actually, and I'm probably going to regret not starting it, but I don't want to go through it too fast, you know? So I feel like spreading out the episodes between Wednesdays is a good idea. All right, let's see. Who are you? Amnesia, have you guys heard of the game Amnesia? JJW, thank you so much for the sub. Thank you so, so much. I really appreciate it. You're amazing. Hopefully we will see you again next Wednesday for, what is it, episode five that we're gonna be on? 
Wow, we're going to be on episode five of The Walking Dead. All right, so for now, let's check out what Hitman Lee VT is doing. He's playing Amnesia Dark Descent, which looks kind of cool. So let's check that out. All right. Well, thank you guys so much for hanging out today. We will do this raid and then I will see you guys again shortly and coming up next week for my birthday. Hopefully we'll have a fun birthday stream to do. So bye guys. Thank you so much for hanging out. Have a great day.
eyes on fire. I wish I could. I'm going inside now because it's dark. Uh, I need some sort of. Ah, no, thanks. You'll be fine. No, no. 